Welcome to the video guys, in today's video I will be getting straight to the point. If you don't know already and you're on that camo grind, you need to be jumping into the game mode that is Invasion. Invasion basically allows computerized bots that just walk in straight lines on the map and these count just as much as regular players. As you can see from these clips, it's very easy to start getting 4 or 5 kills without much effort and the game mode itself has no skill based matchmaking. So with no skill based matchmaking it allows for a lot more relaxed gameplay, you know other people camo grinding, trying different guns, no one's really sweating the meta. To find these bots you're going to look for the helicopters that are covered in a cloud of smoke. This is a clear indication of where the bots are dropping. Once you've found the drop point of these bots, they're going to typically spawn there over and over again. So you're going to want to find yourself a little building or a nice high spot where you can farm these. Now a little bit of advice, you're going to want an ammo crate because you do run out of ammo very quick. But also you might want to consider a tactical insertion. Now the reason you might want to consider one of them is simply because when you die and you go back to spawn it can take a while to get back to that original building. There are vehicles located around the map that can make this a bit easier but sometimes you do get caught in that spawn cycle of spawn die spawn die which can be very frustrating. But if you are going to compare this to a 6v6 multiplayer it is just generally a lot more peaceful a lot more relaxed and therefore a lot more enjoyable if you're having to put hours and hours into this game. You will still need to probably drop into the domination just to finish off the final camo challenges because the only downside to the actual bots is that they don't count towards your camo grind only your weapon xp but as a whole i just find it a lot more relaxing and a lot more enjoyable than constantly fighting against skill based matchmaking hopefully this video has helped you guys if it has don't forget to hit that like button I will be uploading daily videos about everything to do with Modern Warfare 2. Not only my own progress, but also helpful videos to help you along the way with yours. So if that is of interest to you, then don't forget to hit that sub button and I'll see you in the next video.